Hello and welcome to Sunday's show at the Wacky Bookshelf. For those new here, this channel is all about books you didn't know about. If you are a returning subscriber, we thank you for watching our videos and building the channel. We are a community of explorative readers, and we are always open to new book suggestions. All of our book reviews can be found in the description below, along with our merchandise and book blog. Please leave a like, comment, share, and subscribe to the channel for new content. Thank you for your support, and now on to today's book. The Fellowship of the Ring is the first part of J.R.R. Tolkien's epic fantasy trilogy, The Lord of the Rings. The story begins in the peaceful land of the Shire, where Frodo Baggins, a young hobbit, inherits a mysterious ring from his uncle Bilbo. Gandalf the Wizard reveals the ring's true nature as the One Ring, created by the Dark Lord Sauron to dominate Middle-earth. Realizing the peril the ring poses, Frodo embarks on a perilous quest to destroy it. Alongside his friends, Samwise Gamgee, Merry, Pippin, Aragorn, Legolas, Gimli, and Boromir, Frodo forms the Fellowship, a diverse group tasked with aiding him in the quest to reach Mount Doom and cast the ring into the fiery chasm where it was forged. Their journey takes them through treacherous lands, facing dangers and encountering allies and adversaries as they strive to protect the ring from falling into Sauron's hands. In The Fellowship of the Ring, the tale commences in the Shire, where Frodo Baggins inherits the One Ring from his uncle Bilbo. As the wizard Gandalf unravels the ring's true nature and the imminent danger it poses, Frodo accepts the responsibility of its destruction. Accompanied by his loyal friends, Sam, Merry and Pippin, Frodo embarks on a perilous journey, soon joined by Aragorn, a ranger and heir to the throne of Gondor, Legolas, an elven archer, Gimli, a dwarven warrior, and Boromir, a man from Gondor. Together they form the Fellowship of the Ring, sworn to protect Frodo and aid him in his quest to destroy the Ring. Their odyssey leads them through diverse landscapes, from the lush beauty of Rivendell to the treacherous mines of Moria, where they encounter ancient evils like the Balrog and the loss of Gandalf. They seek refuge in Lothlorien, guided by Lady Galadriel and the wisdom of the Elves. As the Fellowship travels, they confront challenges internal conflicts, and the growing influence of the Ring's malevolent power. Tensions rise, especially concerning Boromir's struggle with the temptation of the Ring. Ultimately, the Fellowship faces a decisive moment at Aemon Hen, where Frodo decides to continue the quest alone to protect his companions from the Ring's corrupting influence. He and Sam set off towards Mordor while the others scatter. Merry and Pippin are captured by orcs, Boromir sacrifices himself defending them, and Aragorn, Legolas, and Gimli pursue the orcs to save their friends. The first part concludes with Frodo and Sam setting out on a separate path, knowing the weight of the task ahead. The Fellowship is fractured, scattered, but with a common purpose, to protect Middle-earth from the looming darkness of Sauron's return. The Fellowship of the Ring is rich with themes and messages, it highlights the power of friendship, loyalty, and sacrifice in the face of overwhelming adversity. The bonds forged among the members of the Fellowship underscore the importance of unity and shared purpose in confronting evil. Additionally, the book delves into the nature of power, temptation, and the corrupting influence of absolute authority. The Ring serves as a metaphor for the allure of power and the moral dilemmas individuals face when in its possession. Moreover, the narrative emphasizes the heroism found in ordinary individuals. Frodo, a humble hobbit, embodies resilience and determination in the face of unimaginable challenges. His journey symbolizes the potential for courage and selflessness within everyone, regardless of stature or lineage. In summary, the Fellowship of the Ring lays the groundwork for an epic adventure, showcasing Tolkien's masterful world-building intricate storytelling, and timeless exploration of themes that resonate with readers across generations. 
And that concludes Sunday's wacky book summary. Thank you for watching the video. If you enjoyed this content, please consider giving it a thumbs up and subscribing to the channel. This book and many more can be found below in the description. You can support our community by engaging in the comments section and share if you think others would enjoy this content as well. Thank you again for visiting the channel and we will see you around soon.